Don is so passionate about his role as a conservation agent. Uh, I think him and I always compete as to who is going to switch off the lights in the building. So he's dedicated, he's passionate, and he's always present. Uh, and also, secondly, uh, conservation in most cases generates tension and conflict and strong debate. I can assure you that Dawn's interactions with the public, be it residents, business people, are always pleasant. Mm -hmm. I have not had a single issue regarding conservation that has been escalated to the town manager's office in for nine years. And so tonight, the Board of Selectmen will, will recognize Don McAdam, the Conservation Administrator. Uh, he received the Conservation Administrator of the Year Award from the Massachusetts Association of Conservation Commissions on March 3rd, 2018. Uh, the MACC noted that Don has consistently demonstrated professionalism and patience and takes the extra time to help applicants understand the work of the commission and to assist applicants with the process. Don's colleagues and Conservation Commission members noted that he goes above and beyond on a regular basis, and they greatly appreciate everything he does for the Commission and for Community Hopkinton. And the Chair of the Conservation Commission is here tonight, uh, in case he has any words to share. Uh, on behalf of the Conservation Commission, uh, you know, we want to express our gratitude to Don, and I echo uh, Mr. Colombo's uh, comments. Uh, this is certainly an award that is well deserved for Don. Um, I've worked with him for a long time now, uh, close to I think 16 or 17 years, and Don consistently um, is professional. He's enthusiastic. Um, his knowledge of the regulations um, with the Wetlands Protection Act and the bylaw really is what helps our commission to run efficiently and effectively. And I can't uh, thank, him, thank him enough because he really um, allows us to do our job very well and for us to come to the meetings prepared. So, Don, thank you and congratulations. Thanks, Jeff. Thank Thanks. you, board, for taking the time to recognize me. I know you got a busy schedule. Thank you very much. Oh, we're not done. Oh, we're not done. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I have a couple. You've done a great job protecting our community and protecting our natural resources. But you've also done a great job navigating the process and staying within the law to make sure that everybody gets a fair look and shake at how things play out. So I congratulate you for that. I know it's not easy, and uh, I think you've done a, done a fantastic job, and I hope you will continue to do a fantastic job for another 18 years. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, you know, we're lucky up here to have a number of outstanding groups. and. I'm not trying to offend anybody by not mentioning anybody, but uh, you know, yours, um, you know, police, fire, teachers, um, people do an outstanding job throughout the town. But uh, for you to be recognized for this uh, really, really says thanks. so. Thanks a lot. Well, Mr. McAdam, this is all very nice, um, but I must ask you if there's any truth to the rumor that you were responsible for the flood in town hall. I have been told <laughs> you love wetlands and you wanted to create your own private one on the third floor. Is that true, Mr. McAdam? It did happen next to my workstation today. I, don't, I wasn't there when it blew. I always saw a replication. He's banging on the pipe right now. <laughs> <laughs> blew it open. Just oh, before you got my Well, I'm glad we've cleared that up. Yeah. In that case, congratulations. And, and, and I have to say, um, this description of Don, all these words about professionalism, patience, he sure has been patient with me any time I've, I've gone up there with a question. No, just, just so pleasant. Um, you know, taking the extra time, um, going above and beyond. And, and I think sometimes you hear people talk about going before the Conservation Commission, and it's like, oh my gosh, the great Oz. Um, maybe Jeff is the great Oz, I don't know. but. He is. Um, I, certainly, I, I don't think that's uh, that's yeah. our board because of Don, and uh, you're just uh, you're always a delight and always so patient, and everything that's said about you is absolutely true, and we're, we're really lucky to have you. So congratulations, this is <coughs> certainly well deserved, and I'm glad you cleared that question up for me. Hopkinton is very very lucky to have someone like you, and it's not a surprise to see you on here. 
but it's nice to see it recognized. So congratulations. Thank you, Brandon. Well, this the makes last it, time you're going to get anything nice out of me. <laughs> <laughs> this makes it real easy for me. You know, it, 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 you know I, I echo what everybody said, you know, and, and to what uh, Mrs. Sestari said, you know, we're so lucky, you know, to be on, on, on our, all these volunteer boards, to, to have the professionals in place. You know, uh, Elaine went for all, all the years on, on planning board, and Zach keeping everything running, and you on the um, on the uh, Conservation Commission. Just like, just, just like um, people said before, Going up, going uh, to a conservation commission usually means oh, you're going to be it's going through hell. <laughs> but you know, it, it's always fair. I've been on both sides with uh, with Concom, and it's it's always fair. Nobody feels as though um, that uh, they had a any any kind of a bad taste in the mouth when they left. And really, thanks for everything that you've done. Thanks for being with us. Sorry you lost so much hair with us. <laughs> But hopefully the, the, the next uh, 20 years uh, are good to you and you're good to us. So thanks so much. I really do appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, folks. Mm -hmm. Thanks, guys. 7 o'clock. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.